I'm afraid of the vastness of the ocean, the unknown of what's beneath the surface of the water. But I know that the only way to conquer my fear is to dive down. And that's how I discovered free diving. Over time, my love for free diving is starting to grow. And just like any other sports, it has its own risk and danger. So I decided to learn it from the very beginning. I traveled. And found a tribe. Welcome to the tribe! Welcome to the tribe! Welcome to the tribe! Freedive Tribe PH sa Mabini, Batangas. Bukas yung introduction to freediving course. Freedive Tribe welcomes everyone from all different walks of life. And there are so many things you can do here. From camping out in their tipi huts, doing yoga exercises in Shala, Working from the beach with a stunning sea view in front of you. Meeting wonderful people. To learning how to freedive. The tribe can spoil you with all these things. I tried uh, different sports like basketball, volleyball, badminton, even uh, mountaineering. All of the sport, it involves time. Kailangan mo ng speed, kailangan you have to break the time. In freediving, you have to prolong your time. You have to make slow things down. Kailangan talaga mas relax, mas effective. It's about uh, perfection. Kasi in free diving, pag mali yung dive plan mo, everything will follow na sirala. Yon. Kaya na ano sa free diving? Na hook. Nahuk. Yes. Free dive tribe offers a two-day introduction lesson to teach free diving in baby steps. Day 1 includes dry briefing which will teach you free diving theories, breath hold exercises, and equalization. Then, water training comes next to make you comfortable in the open water. During the training, you will descend underwater using a line. This is for you to get used to taking slow and train yourself to be more relaxed. Tapos lang namin mag water training. But this afternoon, babalik kami for a fun dive. The afternoon dive will teach you how to duck dive and do proper finning, which obviously is something that I need to improve. And everything else was just me having fun. One of the key factors to be effective in freediving is relaxation. That's why day two starts with a basic yoga session. I find free diving and yoga like they sort of supplement each other when it comes to the practice of mindfulness and stilling the mind. So with yoga, kasi, if we talk about the physical practice, the asanas, the posture, what it asks you to do is to become still with your breath whenever as you move through the different postures of the physical practice of yoga. Same as what I observe in free diving, uh, as you go deep and then as you hold the breath, you want to make sure that one, you're comfortable with you holding the breath, you want to make sure that your body is relaxed. So that's almost the same thing that we do is for both disciplines like yoga. I may have self-taught my way to free diving, but it should never be the same to you. Learn it with the best certified instructors. And remember, never dive alone. <laughs>